Hello my dear friends and welcome. Often I come across a situation where I want to access the files available on my home PC when I am outside maybe from my laptop or from my mobile device. In this video we will show you how to do it using Google Backup and Sync and it is absolutely free for personal use. Of course there are few other options available but they are either costly or not that easy to set up. With no further delay let's get close to the action. I just created a folder in my desktop with the name G folder. It contains my home budget excel and my resume as a word document. Once we complete the setup we will be able to read and modify these files from laptop from mobile and literally from anywhere. Download backup and sync from Google. Install the same in your PC. This app is available for Mac PCs as well. Once installation completes, open it. Sign in with your Google account. By default, desktop my documents and pictures are enabled for accessing from anywhere. But this may result in slow performance. So I personally recommend sharing only the required folder. This can be done just by clicking on choose folder over here. Here it is asking whether you want to sync your existing contents of your Google Drive to this PC. If you want you can do it, but I'm going to disable this for now. Click on start. Wait for the process to complete. At the end, you should find a tick mark over the folder. You are ready to read, edit the contents of this folder from anywhere. Let me first try it from my laptop. In laptop open drive.google.com. Log in with same Google account. Click on computers. Select my computer. As you can see, in my laptop I could access my home PC folder. Let's try to edit a file. Now let's try from my mobile. Open Google Drive. If you don't have Google Drive, please install the same from Play Store. Click on Computers. Select My Computer. As you can see, from my mobile also I could edit a file that is available in my home PC. Finally, let's verify if these updates are reflected in my home PC. Yes, changes are available here. I hope it was helpful. Thanks for watching.